victims. A group of armed robbers have tied up their victims, pointed guns in their faces, demanded money, and stolen their cars. The youngest of this group, 16 years old. The oldest is 22. Tonight, we have a good look at the faces of these suspected criminals. These pictures released today by Tucson police. The four are behind bars facing serious felony charges. Not on your side's Kevin Keene takes us to the scene of one of their crimes and explains the consequences they face. Tucson police say a 16-year-old strolled into Pawn Stop on North Oracle last week. This surveillance video shows that teen, Stephen Robles, before police say he pulled out a gun, ordering the employee to the ground. Anytime anyone points a gun at you from two feet away, you know, nothing to sneeze at. That employee was manager Ralph Hasty, who says he was less surprised about the armed robbery in progress than about something else. I didn't really sense any danger from the young man. He was very polite, very courteous, clean cut, well dressed, talked nicely. Talking nicely, demanding money and gold, Hasty says. He adds Robles ordered him to tie himself up using an iPhone cable as the 16-year-old took his time filling a bag with electronics. He really didn't know what he was doing, and anybody who tries to hold up a pawn shop is crazy because we've all got very advanced security systems and uh, alarm systems. Police arrived, Robles dropped the loot, and got away. But not for long. Days later, police made their arrest. Is, is that the man we're talking about? That's the one. Also behind bars, 15-year-old Alexandria Gallego, 22-year-old Orlando Robles, and 19-year-old Samuel Torres Garcia. Police say all four of these young adults were involved in up to eight armed robberies over the past few months in Tucson. Often they were together. It started off with just an armed robbery, um, a handgun and taking people's money. It went from there to tying them up, taking their cars and kept progressing. Progressing, racking up felony charges of armed robbery, aggravated robbery and assault. Other charges are pending. These are serious charges and... and this isn't, like you said, this isn't a shoplifting, this isn't, this isn't a joke because they're kids. They put a lot of fear into people. When you see his picture, what goes through your mind? Uh, I'm just glad he's in jail. And they each are in jail tonight. Investigators and prosecutors are looking at each of the eight armed robberies in the past few months to see what other charges apply. They could be kidnapping and grand theft auto. Kevin, over just a few months, these teens and adults caused a lot of damage and fear, a real fear in people. At each of those stores, there were store employees who became victims because police say because of these people. And some of them we talked to today thank police and the public for helping catch this group. Kevin, thank you.